I like how during uh, there's a part of the song where, when when you get to like 150 uh, combos in this game, the game goes like this. <laughs> They're just like, I did it. So it's just like, ooh. <laughs> Anyways, let's get back to it. Oh, they're like a uh, Jesus almost from Tekken. Here, I'll even pull out the thing for you to watch. Watch this. <laughs> I got this. I got this from a friend a long time ago. Uh, where's GameStop? Come on. <laughs> this this hangs behind my monitor. Tekken Five. No war. I mean, he was my—he still is my favorite Tekken character. But I bought these like some time ago. I thought they would be comfortable, and they are. I actually have shorts versions of them for like swimming, or when it's hot. <laughs> but yeah, <laughs> good old Jinkazama car cardboard cut out. Oh my god. <laughs> I should make it a little bit higher so it doesn't look so short behind my setup, but he guards my setup. <laughs> yep. I also have the Tekken 4 Jin hoodie and the Tekken 6 Jin hoodie-ish. <laughs> Now the only thing that bothered me about Tekken 4 Jin uh, outfit was the red shoes. It doesn't match with the rest of the outfit. But otherwise, cloth. Cool. Cool. But whenever I play Tekken 5, I would normally go with this Player 1 outfit. Because the Player 2 outfit, while it looked like the Tekken 4 hoodie, the colors were a little off. So that turned me away from it. Alright, let's go do, uh, let's do this song. Also, whenever I'm playing on Supernova 1 and 2, I always pick Ed Wolf. I always pick Emmy because she's the best girl. And stage three, it always reminds me of uh, Neon Genesis Evangelion, so I like that snake a lot. Alright, here we go. Hmm. Yep. The A AT feel. <laughs> I believe it's called the Animo. Yeah, I have. Right in front of me, I have one, two, three, four, five <laughs> Evangelion figures. So, two of them I won from round one. Uh, this one, I have two others of Misato that I got when I was in uh, Akihabara. And uh, I have two others that I got when, well, one I got from online, and the other one I won from. Have you heard of the, what do you call it? It's, it was called like the factory or something. It was an, an arcade in in Tokyo that looked like a like a Hong Kong movie. Yeah, I got this Asuka from there. I'll show you. I could have easily just bought this at any of like the stores, but winning it was always more special to me. Tada! Where is the name? No, where's the GameStop cam? Tada! Sundress Asuka. So. But the other ones I was mentioning, I got these two from, uh, what do you call it? I got these, this Ray one, this is the Q Posket, and this Asuka figure from round one. Unrelated to round, or even Galen, I got this, this is the most recent thing I won, besides the Gudetama behind me. 
from round one. The uh, Shinobu from uh, Demon Slayer. Did you strive? Did you strive? Oh, Asuka. Yeah. I, I mean, either you really like her or like... Um, or you just you just kind of like like why is she so mean to Shinji? But it's just her way of protecting herself because she's she she doesn't think anyone believes in her, so she she needs to show everyone else that she is worth uh, her existence, basically. Hurdle for the longest time for playing Dance Dance Revolution was that I would only ever do standard as like the highest difficulty. That's like all I could do. But now that I have a dance pad I could go a little bit more wild on, because it's more durable and sturdy, I could actually do heavy songs now. I just need to wear shoes, so. And it gives me more incentive to get comfortable with my shoes. I actually learned something new about my shoe day. Here, I'll show you. <laughs> i put this on. Roulette song. Something new about my shoes I learned today. So, it has this flap here. These are Onitsuka Tiger shoes. I didn't know, like for when I wore it like this, it was really, uh, it was really flat. Or like, I would feel like a little bit of a bend in the back. But when I folded it in, when I wear the shoe like this, there's less, it's less, um, it's more comfortable. So it actually stay on my foot. So I'm just like, oh, this is actually pretty good. So maybe I'll stick with it. I can actually use these shoes more effectively now. As much as I like my athletic shoes, these are, I feel like these are more for casual uh, wear. I like how flat they are on the bottom, so it wasn't catching on to the screws that are top-mounted. 